it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So here I am back in my mini happy planner horizontal that I use as a journal and I'm super excited to be planning with my newest stickers. These are the Year to Shine stickers. If you guys aren't familiar with these I'm so excited to use them. I just got them um, from the most recent um, warehouse sale. These were not part of the sale but the other two books that I purchased as part of the sale I ended up saving so much money on those that it made the shipping for these worthwhile. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Let me pull up my chair here. I'm stuck now. Ugh. Goodness gracious. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is actually white this out. Now the color scheme doesn't match. Well, it kind of does. The green does and the blue does, so I'm going to make that work. There we go. Okay, first thing I want to do though is find something that goes in here. So, if I go with the blue and the green, there's a lot that I can use in this. So, and those florals, I cannot get over those florals. Possibly this, to keep my hand there. Um, let's see. She has fire in her soul. Let's see, dream. Oh, okay, I like that. Time to shine, rise, shine. There's so many good ones in here. I like the You Glow Girl. We'll go with that one for now. And see how the blue matches perfectly with that. I haven't used, I don't think I've used as many blue stickers as I think I have, but um, I don't know, with this, I just, I loved the colors. I loved the, I don't know, I just fell in love with this book and I wasn't able to get a, um, my hand on any of like the Teresa Collins stuff. So I was so, so sad when this wasn't at uh, my Michaels, and then when I finally did get the chance to purchase it originally, it was just so, so expensive for shipping to Canada, so I had to kind of give up the dream for a bit, but I've been able to, to make it work now. So what I'm going to do, I feel like I'm going to go back to kind of the style that I did a previous week, just focusing on little florals here and there just keep it really really simple so i've got the green and the blue so let's kind of focus on that let's do that here now i only have a couple of greens so let's see i have a green there yeah and it's mostly pinks and purples but I'm sure I could make those work absolutely. Uh, whoop. Um, so if I put it there, there, no, I'll just kind of have to go like this, and that's fine. So even if I put them like this, then I love the tiny florals. I'm just looking in the back as to what else I have. Love the tiny florals, but I won't be able to use them all. There's those. Those are pretty. I'm cutting my hand there actually. These are gorgeous. Those are pretty too. Don't have enough fingers. And those ones as well. Okay. I think I might have to use the, I think it's copper. It's not really gold. I'm going to have to use some of the copper that's in here. I kind of don't want to. Oh, I kind of want to stick to this and some of these. I'm trying to find a way to make that work. Okay, what I think I might do is a mix of this with this washi. So let's get my scissors. And actually, no, I don't do this with scissors. Put this on Saturday. 
okay. I won't use this one just yet. Keep it on the back of my hand here. Then use these. As well. Oh, I am liking it so far. Okay, so the next question is what I'm going to do in the next row. So I feel like I'm kind of liking the vibe that the rows are matching. Hmm. And I like these, but are they small? I'm always still wanting smaller. I don't know why. Okay, there we go. Cute little bitty ones. So I can use the blue here. And I'm going to add something else to that. I just don't know what yet. And then I'll add blue here. Okay. Now, I do feel like I need to add a blue there, but you won't really see the word of the day by doing that. So let's see. I feel like this is a corner that I could put a bigger floral. I say bigger, but not like loads bigger. I'm taking two because I'll do one like this. And I feel like I could put one here. Pretty. I do like these though. I'm going to put these back down where I found them. Ah, those are gorgeous too. I'll have to use those in a different spread. Uh, I don't mind that they're not going back in the exact same spot. Some of you guys might go crazy over that, but ooh. Now I'm going to use green actually for this one. And I sometimes do this where I put the floral down before I put the little box down. This is normally a box that will have my one word of the day, but I like that look better. Cute. Now I want to add something to those to just make them stand out a little bit more because I feel like there is just a blue splatter and something to add to those as well. So let's look through. Ooh. What if I did a hexagon for that day. I'd have to lift these up and just try it out. It's my neighbor's dog barking. Oh yes, I'll do the same on this side with this one. And actually I'm thankful that these coming if these are coming up easily enough. I don't have to worry too much about it. Okay, and then place this down. Like so. Oh, I love that. Yes, I clapped. <laughs> um now what can I add to those to make those stand out a little bit more? I could add a is there smaller? I always want smaller. Um, hmm. I kind of wish there were like different color sparkles. You know what I mean? Maybe not those. What if I did those two, but I already used florals like that. So, rise to shine and then reach for perfection. I like this too. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna, no, I don't like the reach for perfection on that one. I might do this one. Living a beautiful life. Okay, and then I see these sparkly things. I'm going to put them around the page. It's very simple, but it goes with the blue and the green that are already in here. 
So just add a little bit of sparkle. I know, and I mean, I didn't put a something there for the word of the day. I, I don't actually mind too much, but I do. Oh, I like that layering very much. Very, very much. I like that layering. Something up here in the corner. Ooh. Oh, that wasn't a pleasant noise. And something. No, you know what? I will leave it. I like it. It's simple, but still super pretty. And I know the foils are going to be really hard to take a picture of, but I love the blue and the green. And then once it's actually filled in, it's going to be super pretty. All right, but that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day.